everyone, it's me, that guy from Team Niederdorf. It's been a while. By a while, I mean a few days, but whatever. Um, anyway, this is kind of a random video. I have some packages that came while I was away in North Carolina, if you didn't see my update video. This is some stuff I acquired in North Carolina. And then that is my trusty unboxing knife. So, we're going to be unboxing some packages and going through concerty stuff I got from my favorite bands and whatnot. <coughs> I apologize if I cough a lot during this video, I'm a little sick. So, without further ado, we have a t-shirt that I'm currently unfolding, so enjoy the cover of that very exclusive photo book by the very talented Brittany Boyce. I'm pretty sure her website is BrittanyVoicePhotos.com. Anyhow. That is the front of the shirt. American flag says the color morale. <coughs> A nice Fruit of Loom logo. And turn it around. And then it says, you'll never know what you have until it's gone through hell for you. Which was some pretty true words. And as I said, a limited to 50, I think, photo album of Escape the Fate, photographs by Britney Voice. There we go. There's all the contact info. <laughs> and I'll just sort of do a quick flip through. Because I know she'd be mad. I don't think she'd be all that mad if I showed you some stuff. Um, as you can see, it's signed. Uh, you got Robert, Craig, TJ, and Kevin. I was actually on a stage like that at Warp Tour. Because I had some cool friends. Oh, dude. That is sick. <laughs> wow, it's been a while since I looked through this. Anyway, this has some, like, cool photos you won't find anywhere else. And this sums it up really well. If you want to pause it and read it, you can. Or I can narrate it. <clears throat> In a world where we currently live in a world where a photo can be posted to social media and seen by thousands of people in seconds just like this video. We often feel obliged to post something exciting right away rather than keep it private for a minute. She wanted to make this book to bring back the suspense of print. It's the feeling you get when you open the favorite band's CD case and flip through the booklet for the first time. That was her inspiration for creating this. On May 28th, 2015, she flew out to L.A. to document Escape the Fate while they record their new record, Hate Me. Good album, by the way. Three weeks later, we started the Vans Warp Tour, which I was at. <laughs> there are just some photos that I took captured throughout that time, most of which can only be seen in this book. So, if you are... At a date coming up for the Hate Me Tour, I highly suggest picking one up. It's like 30 bucks or something. And I already have one of these, but I picked this up for one of my buddies. It's a VIP laminate. Though we missed the VIP session. <laughs> Funny enough. And got a dog tag. Anyway, it says escape the fate. Uh, the thing I nabbed out of everyone's hand was this set list. They're just throwing them out. Everyone's hands are already touching, and my hand just comes out and grabs it. Got TJ, Craig, and Kevin to sign it. It was a pretty good set. Not as good as San Francisco, and I'm sorry, my face was like, whoa. Not as good a set as San Francisco, but really good set nonetheless because I love this band and you won't find many of these and then of course the big ticket item is 
this side, and I believe bass drummer Tom Head. Looks more like a Tom Head, floor Tom. We got Kevin Thrasher, says he loves me. Robert Ortiz, Craig Mavitt, TJ Bell, and it says Escape the Fate. Yeah, because I'm a boss. Anyway, I just realized I covered my unboxing knife. Do not reach around for sharp objects at home, kids. <laughs> now, without any further ado, let's open up these boxes. Alright, so box number one. Ah, shit. Okay, box number uno. One moment while you see me unbox things. Shit, camera went dark, I apologize. Remember, never a dull moment. Remember, only cut towards yourself if you are a trained professional. Anyway, back to the matter at hand. We have... Not one, but two pops. The elusive Carnage and Anti Venom. Now, if I could just get them out of the box, that'd be wonderful. Please stand by as I do that. And now. Venom, Carnage, and Anti-Venom. He looks almost like an exact reprint of Venom, but in red. And then, we have Anti-Venom, which is a little cooler. Teeth are a little more messed up. Anyway, shit. These fill in a gap. No, not sure if this has my name on it. It does, okay. Well, then mystery box, because I really forget what's in here. Come on. Come on. Hi guys, enjoy my face. I'll like cut this motherfucking box. And we have another box. And within that box we have US Agent from Kamikaze. Dun, da, da, da. So, what happens when U.S. Agent Carnage and Anti-Venom walk into a bar? And last but not least, hopefully this box will actually cooperate with me. Cooperate box. Cooperate and it'll all be over soon. Sounded like something. And it is. Da -da -da -da. A little spoiler alert. If you looked right there. Hi guys, that's me again. And we have get out. Ta da zombie Morbius. To go with my other Morbius. And now, that is everything for my random unboxing. Anyhow, if you like this video that went a little long, like, share, subscribe. If you didn't, pass it on to someone who will. Or if you want to torture them, send it on over. 
Anyway, break on three. One, two, three, break.